ball screen, because this is huge. So many ball screens now. Seems like at the college level, it's all draw and kick or ball screens, and occasionally some fade screens. But the rest of it's kind of gone, gone by the wayside. All right, now, on ball screens. I'm going to have you come up and set a ball screen, okay? You're going to take, the, take off the dribble. Now, you're going you're gonna, to you're gonna use the... What I want you to do is offense. I want you to make sure you're coming off the screen shoulder to shoulder. Talk about this drives me crazy. Watch college games. Watch pro guys. They don't use the screen offensively. And these guys are doing their, they're doing their little defense on ball screens, but they don't really need to because this guy doesn't come off the screen. He's lazy, and he doesn't want to work, and he doesn't want to go off shoulder to shoulder, so he doesn't really create anything. All he does is just, he, these guys are over here trying to figure out how to defend it. You don't have to defend it. You're going to get down and come through it. If he's, if, if he's going to be, if he's going to just take off from here on the dribble, go. Why, why, why even talk about it? All right, now, now they are going to, now they are going to use it. So you're going to move over here just a little bit. Okay, now you can see that they're going to, he, now he's learned, now he's going to come off shoulder to shoulder. He's going to brush shoulders with his screener. Okay, now, you're going to walk your guy down so that he's going to come in there. All right, now, stop right there. Now, you see that coming. Screen's coming as loud as you can. This is what I teach. Not everybody teaches this. I want the guy that's covering the screener, I want him straight up the floor. This is where I want him to reroute him. I don't want him rerouting here. I don't want to reroute him here. I want him right up here, just directly right here. But I want him to maintain contact. Mark's got a kid here that's 6'9". He's about 3 and change. He has trouble with these. And part of it is, I think, is that he's trying to get out here and he's trying to dance out here five or six feet away from it. And even when he's in great shape, he's going to have And I apologize for having my back to you guys all night, but uh, he's in, he just can't guard guys out here. He just can't do it. You see some NBA post guys. They can't do it. College guys, it's really hard for them. I think really the best way to be able to effectively have a big guy that has trouble is to keep contact with the screener right here. It's really all you need to do. So now you're going to go under and up and guard him, and then you're going to recover. All right? So let's see you guys do it. Start back over here. Come back over. Let's start right from the start. Okay? Good. Okay, here we go. Walk him down into it. Good. Recover? Good. Not, not bad. Good. Do it again. 